Hi, I'm Pat Patterson. Welcome to the best of California. Today, I've got the Wienermobile to take off in. So I'm so excited to be here with the Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. And these are the people that get to travel around all the time in this wonderful thing. I got Callie Polk and Colin Jay, and you guys tell me a little bit about your adventures in this incredible machine. Yeah, we are two lucky dogs. We are the hot doggers that get to travel all over the country with the Wienermobile. And so our stop is in Los Angeles this week, and we've been having a great time. They're gonna drive me around to these retro places. And Colin, when did you start doing all this? Yes, yeah, so we started this job in June, so it's actually a year long. So we go for 12 months, we go to a new city every single week. We were just in Tucson, Arizona a couple days ago, and we're headed to San Diego next. And the, what's the most asked question about this thing? Ooh, do you guys sell hot dogs? Yep. <laughs> and we actually don't. Yeah. It's a myth. Yeah, it's a myth. It is a giant hot dog, but we just serve up smiles and the wiener whistles. They expect you to be a good humor truck or something. Yeah. <laughs> and, and what are some of the other things people ask? Well, people ask, too, if we personally own it, which is pretty funny to me, but we actually do work for Oscar Mayer. So we work for Oscar Mayer. The Wienermobile has been around for 86 years. So there's been one on the road since 1936 when Carl Mayer, the nephew of Oscar Mayer, created it in the Great Depression to make people smile. I mean, we're still smiling. And I remember when I was a kid at driving around Southern California, that's an older version of this. Yes. It was a real modified looking car kind of thing. Definitely. And And in terms of people using the vehicle. I mean, I'm, I was, I'm amazed we can kind of call you up and you'll come. That's incredible. <laughs> they're, they're like medics with the, with the wiener. Uh, so tell me, how do, do people book you? Yeah, anyone can request the Wienermobile on OscarMeyer.com. It's just a matter of if our boss can make it work on our schedule, if we're in the area. There's only six nationwide, so it can be a little tough. Yeah, but. Yeah. And, and what do you usually go to? Are you going to supermarket openings, that kind of thing? Or? Yeah, so it's actually you know a different thing basically every single week. So this week we're doing a lot of supermarkets. We obviously get to talk to you, which is great. But last week we were doing a lot of classic car shows, which was really fun. We do festivals, fairs. We did one of the cooler things we did was we did a parade in San Juan Capistrano a couple of weeks ago, the Swallows Day Parade, which was really cool. So everything and anything. Yeah. Hot dogs, of course. That's yeah, 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 yeah. So let's open it up yeah, and take a look. Check this thing out. This is incredible. We're gonna go inside to the Wienermobile, Retro California. This is the mothership. This is incredible. Tell me a little bit about how this thing works. Yeah, this is where the magic happens. This is the iconic Wienermobile, and we have a lot of cool Wienermobile stuff. So we have our bun box right here, which is fully operational for all the goodies that we have inside the Wienermobile. We have bun roof up here that we use for parades sometimes, which is pretty cool. Blue skies on the ceiling because there's always blue skies in the Wienermobile. Ketchup and mustard seats, and a lot of more hidden features. Callie, what's your favorite element of the Wienermobile? Oh, that's tough. There's so many cool things. I really like the seat you're in. It's shot bun. You get all the good views when you're driving. You get to wave to all the people as you're on the interstates. It's definitely a meaty magic up there. It's meaty magic. I, this, is, this is a whole different language to me. So uh, so now when you are going places, is is uh, how do you work your itinerary? I mean, you just, I mean, you guys have to be on top of timing and telling people we gotta go and not that kind of thing what's that like yeah absolutely so we go to new city every week obviously and monday is usually the day that we drive there and our bosses do all the hard work of scheduling the events for us so we get the fun job of turning people down exactly we just get to say yes put a smile on our face and make people happy and if we're having fun then everyone else is having fun so it works out so colin let's get going